Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Dragon's Dogma Dark Arisen, where last time we just got started, we really made it absolutely nowhere. We didn't even make it out of town, but that's okay, because now we have our good friend Rook with us, and I just learned, well, I just relearned that they, uh, they talk a lot, but also, I just learned that, uh, good, get some oil here, it's gonna be good for our lanterns, that you can't actually equip Rook with any items. Or equipment. You can give him items. I gave him a lantern and I gave him a pickaxe, although I think he actually already had a lantern. You can't actually give him any items, any, any equipment. I tried. And Brooke just plummeted down that ladder. So he is about as strong as he's going to get for now. Now, along this pathway, we're going to have a merchant, of course, to save. We're going to have some goblins to kill. We're going to have some mice that we can kill and rabbits. But there's also going to be some loot. So, we are going to detour right away. Really, really shouldn't. I should probably just beeline right to the encampment, honestly. But we do have to kill some rabbits as part of our little quest board activity. Okay, but we should be able to get, yep, get some flowers here. Not the ones that we're after just yet. But we'll get there. We'll get there. Okay, we drop down and get that one chest. Mage is periapt. Good for Rook. Not so much for me. All right, let's see if we can stick this landing. To the bone. I will take that. 45 gold later. Honestly, I thought you sunk if you landed in that, so... <laughs> Whoops. And let's see if we can get our good friend Rook over here to mine. So over here. Go! Mind this. Let me see. Th there might be aught here. Go ahead. Come on. Yes! And that's why you give your pawn pickaxes. We got a rock. Good job, Rook. You got a rock. Copper ore. What else? Copper ore. Anything else? Just three? Yeah, three gathers. Good. Not too bad. All right, do we want to take the beach and worry about the goblins, I guess? I guess the goblins are only here at night. That's right. Never mind. Don't have to worry about that. Unusual beach. It is a bit strange, isn't it? Seeker's token. Can turn those in later for rift crystals if we get enough. Oh, got to watch my stamina now that we're not in town. I will worry about breaking all the boxes. Blast arrows, very, very good get. Once I, you know, have an archer. Okay, there's another chest at the end, which I believe can have some really, really potentially good stuff, right? Right up there. Or is that another secret token? Honestly, I can't remember. And then we're going to loop back around and go up top. And we'll get some loot. We'll get some flowers. Oh, there's a secret token. Come on now. There is... There is a sweet spot here. There we go. A mace. Fascinating. Who can use a mace? Not me. That is the... What is that symbol? I can't remember. Alright, well, we'll hold on to it. And either a new pawn can use it, or uh, maybe I can use it at a later time. Oh, you got... Our spud milk out of that. Thank you, Rook. So we'll just do some backtracking. We'll go up here. The encampment's just over to our right. But we also should have someone that is in dire need of rescue. And it's going to be our first bit of combat, so this will be interesting. Unless it's on the way back from the encampment? Nope, there he is. There he is. Go, 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 go. We gotta move. Alright, blitz strike. Go. Yes, sorry, Reynard. I might end up hitting you. You are just getting absolutely pummeled, aren't you? Oh, jeez. Okay, not bad so far. Hey! That was not bad. I am on hard mode, right? Let's just confirm that. <laughs> Should be. 
I am, in fact, on hard mode. Good. All right, Reynard. You are welcome. Thanks for the leather cape, actually. And let's go do some more collecting. Everything we do is going to be kind of in a roundabout fashion. Doing some looting. Doing some slaying. Goblin. Okay, here is some of the sunbright we need. Where is the goblin? Is he in the bush? There you are. But unfortunately for you, I now have fire thanks to Rook. So you go down nice and quick like. Get the rabbit. Get all the sun bright we can. This is only going to bloom during the day. Then we'll have to go out at night looking for the others. Goblin. Where's our goblin friend? Right in here? Yes, actually. I didn't even see you, but I got you. Not too bad. I don't remember where all the chests are, so I'm going to be kind of zigzagging in and out. Large coin pouch. So far, so good. Yes, I mean, grab me fires blaze. There's nothing to kill here right now, but still, I'll take it. Bad time to have to pause the recording, especially since something's coming up behind me. I hope you like the sound of the pond's voice, because it's either all or nothing with them. Kindling is always good to have. Mushrooms are good for stamina. Another coin pouch. Wow, we're getting lots and lots of money. Don't know if there's too much else before the encampment. I know we can loot around all the trees. Oh, but make sure we get enough flowers. And enough rabbits. Okay, so we got the sun bright, but we still need to come back at night. Get that rabbit. We need five rabbits. That should have been, I think, three. Okay, what else is there? Oh, watch your stamina. All right, Bun Bun, sorry. Hey, there we go. Up to level four. Not too shabby. We'll be heading to Bitter Black Isle in no time. I might try and do a, an early Bitter Black Isle run just to really get some overpowered gear. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling. Dragon Spit. Shadow's acting a little weird in some places. I think that might be all the major loot to get. This road will have us to the encampment air much longer. And things are going to kick off once we get in here. Again, watch your stamina. Last chest. More money. Okay. All right, let's head into the encampment and see what's about to happen. Vocation rank increase. Nice. Well, that's pretty great. memory serves i know the way master follow me all right one thing that the pawns do which is such a cool feature is that as they actually learn quest information they will try to guide you which i just think is so so clever hey let's skip everyone of importance let's go right to the riftstone now i haven't given this any thought I haven't thought about what I'm actually going to do to create our pawn. Not yet, at least. But well, we need to search the area. A stone. A strange power. And let's see. I don't... I can't 
can't remember. Is this when we kill the Cyclops? It's been so long. Yes, it is. The beast comes. Hurry. All right, let's see how we do. There's going to be some goblins. We're going to focus on them first. Hopefully we'll get some fire. Okay, knock these guys down. Focus on them. Oh! Oh! And that's hard mode for you. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, it, it's probably good that that happened. It's probably good because I needed I needed to learn my lesson. Rushing in headlong like that is not the way forward. All right, so just stay stay behind him. Okay, there's really no need to be looting right now, Lou, right? Okay, good. Level up. Level 5 already? Goodness. Is that it? Okay, just watch it now. Oh, Rook, you are not looking great. Ooh. And let's go. Climb up. I'm going to try to get to his head if we can. Oh, the stagger's real, though. Tell you what. Let's just... Let's just attack. Let's drop. We're gonna lose all of our stamina. Uh-oh. We're in trouble. Move. We lived. The important thing is we lived. So let's just get our shield up. Did a... Did someone just throw a rock at me? Please don't look at me. Please don't look at me. We're gonna focus on his leg and try to knock him down. All right, Rook. I see what you're doing. Okay, watch it. You're gonna climb to his head? You go right- oh! Yeah, don't get smushed. Come on, fall down. Okay, now we just run around. And we get the kill. Alright, that was an XP for that. Not bad, not bad at all. But you saw the damage that that can do. Wow. We are in trouble. <laughs> and that's with DLC gear, mind you. Keeping us quote-unquote safe. Alright. So, let's report back. Is there any any loot to be gathered? We didn't break any horns, right? Oh, maybe now well, we got some rugged bones, but nothing. Yeah, we didn't break his didn't break his horns. What level are we now? What is our status? We're level six already. Level six, rank two fighter. That is pretty great. We should be able to start getting some more skills here soon. We've done as asked. Let us go and give word of it. Set out from here and we'll be on the path to Grand Soren. Well, we're not going to Grand Soren anytime soon, so just, you know, chill out. Alright, guess we gotta go prove ourselves to the Riftstone. Now, again, I haven't given any thought to my party makeup. Uh, so I don't know. I'm going to go ahead and pause the video here. I'm going to make up my mind what I want them to look like and what they, what I want them to function as. And uh, I'll be back. And ladies and gentlemen, meet Gekonya. That's right, Gekonya. She is a strider. I want her to be picking off all the smaller enemies. Hopefully with some nice buffs from a couple of our mage companions. Rook is probably not going to be sticking around for too terribly long just kind of throwing that out there but for now for now he'll just hang out all right i might actually be looking to borrow some of your mages so we shall see how that works all right sir benny so we got some uh we got some trials coming up we have a mysterious stranger we're gonna have a 
big, big foe coming up here in just a little bit. That'll be interesting. The man of the enlistment oh, do we want to train with only the three of us? We could try, right? Let's see. Let's see if we can get through all the trials. Probably would be better off having a full party. But let's see if we can't make this work. Oh, can I? Never mind. You just go ahead and get that one. I'll get the next. I know they start off pretty easy. Okay. The deadline draws near already. Oh, don't throw. Whoops. We must hurry. There's no time. Is that the last one? Go, 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 go. I can't wait for him to yell, enough. Drop it. Is that it? Enough. There it is. How'd we do? Well done. Thank you. We'll begin. You'll set. All right, is this going to be the targets? Yes. That was not a great start. Yeah, well, I'm working on it. You have a bow, you know. That it? Good. Well done. Now, let's see what this next... This might be the last one. It might just be three. Oh, I think they need magic, though. Okay, not not all of them require magic. Okay, good. Come on. Rook, you need to use magic on this. Did it. Wow. That was well done. Enough. Is that it? That's the fast you. Hey, excellent. Wow, I thought I would actually struggle with that a little bit. Vocation rank increase for Gaconia already? Oh, it goes so fast. This is excellent. So we really should grab another pawn, probably a mage. Maybe one that can focus on some other buffs other than what our good friend Rook can do. So let's take a look and see what is available. Okay. Wow. Wow. I could get some pretty high power people here. So... I know we want to sort, so let's go ahead and do... Do we want to do top ranked? <laughs> let's just search, and let's do... Pawns by level. We'll just we'll stay to the same level. And we will do... Change search conditions. I think really we want sorcerer. We'll do mage and sorcerer. And we'll see... What this looks like. Choose pawn to summon. Yeah, we'll just summon. We'll summon five for now. And see what we get. I don't want to go too overpowered. I mean, I want a challenge. I don't want it to be miserable. I don't think any of these are actual people's mages, though. Are they? Uh, JJ might be. Especially because they're using the Jester's cap. What about, uh, you're level 63. Shinny, you must be a friend of mine. Alright, let's look at this one with the, uh, Jester. Ooh, Saitoth looks kind of cool, though. Alright, let's speak to you. Yes, Arisen. View your details. You have England Thunderboom. I do like England Thunderboom. And Anodyne. Okay, that's healing. You know what? Yeah, we'll just bring you. We'll bring you. We're going to roll with this party for now. Better than nothing. Okay. Gives me my full party. And we will continue to kind of tweak our composition as we go. Okay. So, do we want to take a look at our skills? We have 1,100 discipline points. 
We are desperately going to need some skills, but also augments are so important. Halves the stamina consumed when you lift objects and extends the limit of your health. I mean, I really need both of these. I just don't have enough. I think health is going to be big. So let's see. We're going to go from 660 to... Unless I just got that up to 660, which might have been it. And let's see about... So let's see. Broad cut. Do you like the falling back? Tusk toss. Traces a grand skyward arc with the blade. Skyward... Oh. That might be important because we're going to have harpies up here soon. Springboard could be cool. Symbol attack. Uh, let's get skyward slash. And then I don't think I have enough for anything else. Dire Onslaught actually would have been good. I need those core skills. All right, let's see. Give Gakonia Biting Wind. As well as... Can't do any core skills or augments. Let's do... Let's do Cloud Burst Volley. Okay. And make sure that we change these up. Give you Biting Wind. And Cloud Burst Volley. What will it be today? Uh, did I grab my augment? Nope. Th that's right, because we have to put... That's an extra 100 health. That's nothing to sneeze at. Do I have any more shield skills? No. And Gakanya, you don't have any augments, right? No. Okay. What will it be today? That's pretty good for now. Come again soon. A rift stone. A strange power emanates from... All right, Mercedes. I am Mercedes. I've ordered... All right, so we're going to rest up, and of course, things are going to go down. And we're going to have to fight a Hydra. We'll see how this goes. Uh, you know what I didn't do was set up any explosive barrels. Can I run back and get them? Yes, I can. Right? Let's grab these. See if we can't get them to not eat all of our friends, but drop that. Yeah, we'll, we'll let them handle it for now. Grab another. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. That didn't do very much. Uh-oh. Okay, watch it, watch it, watch it. It's just going to take that down. This reminds me of Dragon Wars, or D-Wars, you know, which is its proper name. Is that the only explosive barrels? Very well could be. Kind of afraid to get too close. Okay, what if I just slash from here? I don't want to get too high. Let's see if we can't cut some off, though. You know, I really did just get the mages just for the... Wow, really? Got the mages just for the buffs. I didn't think I would get them that quickly. Frankly, entirely shocking. <laughs> Knowledge. Not bad. The problem is my discipline points are going to quickly fall behind. Okay, now, you, Reynard, good friend that I rescued, what do you have? Because you've got to have some good stuff, right? Do sell some upgrade materials, and I have lots of money at this point, which is nice. Do you sell anything? Anything? Oh, so here we go. Now I can put some... Shirts on underneath. That makes sense. So I can do a leather chest guard. Bring me up to 246. It's not much, but it is something. So let's do that. Let's do a leather chest guard. Oh, and we can actually get some... We can get some pants. <laughs> oh, oh, good. Oh, the yellow gators are, are quite nice. We'll do the worker's pants. Shoulder cape's not going to help out. All right, let's look at Gakanya. What we can give to you. So throat cutters would be helpful. Short bow would not. Just looking at what is going to help out the most. Novice bracers. Up to 9,000 gold right now, but this is why this is why the extra gold is so... So important. OK, 
Okay, with those boots, you should also be able to wear some... Some pants, yeah? Do some workers' pants for you, why not? Okay. Let's go ahead and buy those. 15,000, holy cow. And we'll start with putting a shirt on. Good. Looking a little bit more presentable. A leather leather cape just has slightly di different elemental resistances. Okay, Kakanya. Put on a cape. Very nice. Take those novice bracers. And the throat cutters. Not too awful, not too awful indeed. Okay. Now, let us talk of business. Oh, you can also do some enhancements. Well, 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 well. How much is it going to cost me? That's a pretty big jump for the trusty sword. Hmm. I say we do that. Let's go right up to level two. Why not? Pelta. Uh, nah, I don't think I'll, I'll worry about that right now. No. Let us talk of business. I am just going to worry about just... Oh, can I go up to level three? Because I have the copper ore. You can skip that? Really? I didn't... I don't think I knew that you could actually skip an upgrade if you have the next one in line, but not the one in between. That's interesting. So we'll do that. What about your short bow? I mean, it's worth it just for the added damage. Okay, for now, that's what we'll focus on. Not, not bad. I think that went way better than I expected it to. Like, much, much better. So our next big task is going to be heading towards Grand Soren. But I don't think we're going to do that. Oh, Liquid Vim. That would have been really good to get. But I don't think we're going to necessarily go to Grand Soren just yet. We do have some more notice board quests to do for Cassardus. And we also have to go back. We need to collect some more flowers. And I think that'll be... Oh, first journal entry. And there is... Is there a mining spot back here? Am I crazy in thinking that? Oh, didn't mean to attack there. Yeah, who's... Oh, there you go, Rook. You're the only one with a pickaxe, so... What else? What else? Copper ore? I'll take it. Very good. So we could certainly get more goblins at night, and we also do need to collect some flowers at night. Um, let's see. Let's take a look at what quests we have. So current quest, off with its head. So this is where we're going to go to the Wake Castle and then head to Grand Soren. Bring the flowers you've claimed, but I still need other flowers. I need to kill some mice. I haven't seen any. Oh, and bandits, not goblins. I need bandits. That's right. Okay. Well, tell you what, this feels uh, like a start of something. I don't know how far we're going to make it, but it's kind of fun. Kind of fun to see, right? So I think next time what we'll do is we're going to head back at night. We will head back towards Castardus, try to finish a few more quests, make a little bit more money, and then we'll begin our quest with Mercedes. We might take a little gander at Witchwood. Haven't quite decided on that just yet, but I'm going to rest up. Let's go ahead and rest for 300. We're going to stay till nightfall. And at that point, I'm going to say that's going to do it for this part of Blue Plays Dragon Song with Dark Arisen. On hard mode, going for Mystic Knight with a ragtag bunch of pawns behind me. <laughs> Wait. Oh, oh no. Oh no. You didn't need to see this. Um, shoot. <laughs> so here's the thing. Um, we just broke the game. I have another pawn, 
by the name of Silverius, if you watched my previous playthrough, and uh, he's still out there because I actually have a backup save file, and he just got returned from helping others and brought back with him 968,000 Rift Crystals. On my other save file, I have approximately 18 million. Um, and oh, look at what we just got. Upgraded Half Chain Hosen, Set of Ladies Garment, Airtight Flask, and the Veterans Periapt. Whoa. Very, very cool. Look at that. An unfamiliar foe times 71 and unfamiliar quest times 50. People are really liking Silverius. Your pawn's equipment has been changed. Uh, how's this, how's this going to work? Because Silverius is on a different character. No, Gekanya, that wasn't you, uh, friend. That was not you that just came back with all that good. But I'm very much confused game. But at any rate, that is going to do it for this episode. I hope you're enjoying half as much as I am, because it is just good to be back here in the world of Dragon's Dogma. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.